Hello everyone. So we are going to make a, a, a Power Apps based game called Superman vs. Darkseid. So basically what this game is about is we are playing the role of Superman and there is a Darkseid who can teleport and we can throw a laser something like this and whoever throws like lasers first will okay so this we lose we restart it now again and fire Oops. so this is how our game is it's purely based on power apps Oops. Boom. Oh. Oops. So here dark side can teleport anywhere we we can move up and down. we can win now so uh, this is something made for the mobile devices where easiest to do up and down rather than using mouse which I'm using right now so. okay I think he's gonna die now last yep here we go okay so we win so this is how the game goes and how we're gonna make it is first of all let's go to power apps uh create a new uh create a blank app uh this is supposed to be for phone so we're gonna take phone layout and for this we need a couple of files uh this is dark side uh, gif of dark side this is gif of superman and these are something you can easily found find on google i'll uh, keep the link below so yeah so since we want it in the portrait mode let's go to the files settings orientation here yeah. and so let's put the required components uh, let's put one image for the background this is the stars so let's call it space background uh, this is the gif of the stars uh, it should it's not visible right now because our background color is white so let's put it black well so now let's expand it uh, let's keep the uh, image position as maybe fit or fill okay fill is better so uh, we need buttons so This is a button. This is the down button and copy this. Uh, let's keep a little bit, make it a little bit bigger and let's 
put the file button. Uh, let's make this red and this green and this green as well oops not this one okay <coughs> now we need a dark side here a superman here first so add image superman Uh, let's keep height as 140 width as 133 uh, X position 0 copy this and put dark side here dark side Uh, let's put it one on. Mm -hmm. so, uh, these position you can change uh, according to your whatever you think is good. Uh, I'll keep this fill just so that it looks a little bigger. Uh, then we need the laser thrown by dark side. So I'm putting. Uh, let's rename them first Superman and then dark side this is dark side laser okay now this is the laser that is going to be thrown by dark side we put the width as 250 and then height as 100 and just so that it's Okay, and we need the laser of Superman as well. So insert a rectangle. Though you can put uh, some GIF like that as well. Just since Superman does not have a fancy light, so I'm just keeping it red line so it's so let's keep it three as height and let's put it just so that it's right over his eyes sorry okay okay so this is how you set up the canvas uh, for the game. Uh, also, you we would need a few other stuff such as you win. Let's keep it at. Uh, let's put it at center. Center and top. And also put a restart button. The full size. And 
the end another image for you lose okay align with center align top and for now let's keep its visibility as false and oops 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 oops, oops. false and and then restart as also uh, let's color it red false next thing is the health line that we need to create so uh, insert a rectangle keep the width as 200 and height as 28 the exposition oh sorry um, color I'll keep it yellow and then I'll, I'll put uh, border color as orange and let's keep the height as 5 okay so let's copy so this one's for superman this one's for that side regroup it and then health bar so let's align it to center and another is another rectangle uh, which shows the health so let's keep the width as 10 and height as 13 color as orange again and then we'll zoom it so that you can move it to here looks good mm. and then uh, copy this paste So all the required things that's needed for the canvas is done. Uh, uh, in the next session, we will uh, talk about animating all those letters, throwing fires, and putting the logic behind uh, the game. Uh, so watch the next video for that.